<laughs> oh, hello, Mr. Woodman. I'm sorry, I didn't answer before. I was finished the project. Good afternoon, Brandon. Yeah, about that. You were supposed to deliver that yesterday. Yeah, well, you know, this is kind of difficult to do, and it has to be perfect. Okay, but when we hired you, you said you could do this kind of projects in one week. Okay, but you need to understand, I had to investigate a lot before starting with this project. And the last time, you failed at delivering the project. And we lost that contract. It was because I had a health problem. I got sick and I couldn't advance with that. I know, but we need to have contracts. That's how the company can pay the workers. I know, boss. In fact, I feel much better now, and this project will be much better. Also, when we call you, you don't answer the calls right away, or you just answer with a message. Yeah, it is because I am in the bathroom. I have a terrible stomachache sometimes. I don't need to know about your stomachaches. I just want you to be punctual. I am punctual. I sign my entry on time. I start work at 7 o'clock, as usual. The last project you sent us had a lot of mistakes, and we had to do it again. Did you know that? Oh, I didn't know that. I did my best, I promise. But, sometimes the client doesn't like it. Did you send a report I asked you for the day before yesterday? It was urgent. Oh, I'm sorry, I totally forgot it. I was doing a lot of things and I just forgot that. Yeah, I suppose so. You have been very busy lately. Although you don't deliver on time. It is because I'm always investigating about new ways to improve the projects we have. I love you investigate and everything, but we also need to have these projects ready on time. As I always say, you can do it fast or you can do it well, but not fast and well. Look, you have six months working here. You should know how we work exactly. I know that perfectly. That's why I investigate. I know I can delay sometimes, but... Sometimes? The only time you finished on time was in the first month. Yeah, well, nobody's perfect, you know, and I am getting used to work online. Anyway, we had to adapt our work to the online mode due to the pandemic, you know. Yeah, and it has been awesome. Working from home is better than going to the office. Well... We give that chance to our creative employees. That way, they can be more creative. Of course, I have had new ideas for the company. I'd like to share with you. Sure, when you come to the office, we'll discuss it. By the way, we're looking for a new worker. A new worker? What position will this worker apply for? Also design area? No, no, we're looking for a person to work 
on the marketing area. Oh, I also studied marketing at the university. It was about five years ago. I didn't know that, but I think we need another person. Do you know anyone? Well, I have a friend. He studied marketing and economy at a famous institution. Oh, he will be good. Then, do you think he can pass an interview today or tomorrow? I am not sure, but I will call him. What I know is that he is not working at the moment. Excellent! We need a marketing expert who can work from Mondays to Fridays. Okay, what skills do you need the person who takes that position have? Well, this person has to be creative, very responsible, punctual, and also loyable. I studied graphic design with him, and I can tell that he is very responsible. Oh, so he's also a graphic designer. That's interesting. He's a skill then. I suppose so. He used to have the best grades in our classroom every month. Maybe I can call him now and ask him if he's interested in taking that job position. Okay then. I will send you his number, and you can call him right now. Alright, thank you. I will call you back in a moment, okay? No, no. Some We're minutes later. To work on the marketing area. Yes, hello boss? Did you call my friend to ask him if he can go to an interview? In fact, we had a short interview by phone, and he also sent me his resume really fast. Seriously, wow, I can't believe it. You see, I told you he was very efficient. Yeah, well... I talked to him and he told me about his work experience. Yeah, I don't know what happened in his last job, but he will never do something wrong. About that, he told me something really curious, you know? It was interesting. Oh, and what did he tell you? <laughs> that I am his best friend and also a really good worker? No, he told me you used to work together in the same company, like one year ago. Oh yeah, we worked together. In fact, he recommended me to work there. That's exactly what he told me. And he also said he got fired because of you. What? No, <laughs> he was not fired. I was fired because I had a delay in one project. It was the most important project in the company lifetime. And you delivered it late. Yeah, well, I was sick at that time, and I couldn't work very well. He was fired because you were in the same team. All the team was fired, is that correct? Mm, maybe, but I was sick. That was unfair. I could sue them. Now I can understand some things. Well, I hired him not only as a marketer. Oh, that's really good. He got the job then. 
he will work well with me. You'll see. He will also be our designer. I'm sorry, but we have to fire you, Brandon. Sorry. What? Why? I mean, we can work well together. You can't do this to me. I already did. He will be the marketer and the graphic designer. That's it. But wait a minute. Is this a joke? Yeah, it is a joke. No, it's not. Come to receive your payment and thank you for your service. I hope you really liked this conversation. If you could improve your English a little more with this video, please subscribe to the channel and share this video with a friend. I'll see you in the next video. Oh, if you have any idea for a next video, just write it in the comments. Take care.